Hey guys, this is Toby and welcome to yet another video and another Motivation Monday where I want to share with you one thought or topic that helps me in my life and that hopefully help you too in yours. Today it's about gratitude, about being thankful. I think first of all it's important to understand that gratitude has almost nothing to do with our life circumstances. Too often we think I would be more thankful if I had a better car, a better job, more money, if I was healthier, all those things. And I say that's bull****. <coughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. I mean, that's not right. I believe gratitude is an attitude that we can practice, that we can train. I, ha I did not interview in all that time a person who would describe themselves as joyful or describe their lives as joyous who did not actively practice gratitude. Um, and for me, it was very counterintuitive because I kind of went into the research thinking that the relationship between joy and gratitude was if you're joyful, then you should be grateful. But it wasn't that way at all. It was really that practicing gratitude invites joy into our lives. And when I say practice, I think this is, this is the part that really changed my life. It changed my family and the way we live every day. When I say practice gratitude, I don't mean kind of like the attitude of gratitude or feeling grateful. I mean practicing gratitude. These folks shared in common a tangible gratitude practice. They either kept gratitude journals. Um, some of them did interesting things like at 1, 2, 3, 4, like at 12, 34 every day. They said something out loud that they were grateful for. They, um, one of the things that we do, like we say grace at dinner. And so now after grace, we go around and everyone in my family says something they're grateful for. It's a decision that we make, whether we want to be grateful or not, whether we want to be thankful for everything that we have or not. Just take you, for example, if you have problems to figure out what to be thankful for, you are watching this video right now. That means you probably have a device or a gadget, like a mobile phone or a computer to watch this on. You have an internet connection. You have the opportunity to learn something for your life or to just enjoy a little bit of entertainment on YouTube. These are all small things you can be thankful for. Mosquitoes. Ah, I'm so grateful for those mosquitoes. One of the first things I'm doing almost every day is I sit down with my coffee in the morning after I just woke up and I'm writing down five things that I'm thankful for. Sometimes it's as simple as I'm thankful that I woke up today. I'm, I'm thankful that I'm healthy. I'm thankful for this cup of coffee. Sometimes it's a little bit more specific. I'm thankful for this day I had yesterday with my wife where we could go out or something like this. I'm thankful for opportunities. I'm thankful for YouTube. I'm thankful for good weather. Or I'm thankful for this wall here. Just, just because it's there and it's nice to have a wall. It can be anything. Just try to intentionally set your mind to being thankful. And after a little bit of practice, it's amazing that you can really find a lot more than five things every day to be thankful for, to be genuinely thankful for. But maybe the first days, it will be a little bit of a practice, it will be a little bit of weird. Maybe you won't feel very thankful, but try to do it every day as an exercise to be intentional about your thankfulness. And this will help you to change your mind, to be more positive. It makes me happy too, that I know whom to address with my thankfulness. So as a Christian, I address God and I really say thank you to Him for everything good that is happening in my life. But even if you don't believe in God, just try to be intentional with your thankfulness. Write down, thank you for this day, thank you for the sun, thank you for whatever you are thankful that day. Before I have another little bonus video for you coming up, just take some time to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already and to leave a thumbs up if you like this video. It actually makes a difference. And don't forget to enjoy your life wherever you are. See you in the next video. Close your eyes for a moment, will you please? And breathe with me. Just close your eyes. And if you will, put your thumb to your middle finger and gather your other fingers around. And let's feel the vibration and pulse of your personal energy as you take three deep breaths with me. Inhale. And as you exhale, just feel the vibration, energy, blood pulsating through your body, through you. And another inhale.
and another inhale. And keep your eyes closed. And let's just think about this day. This day that you have been graced to breathe in and out thousands of times. This day where many of those breaths were taken for granted. You just expected the next one to come. But the truth is there's no guarantee that the next one comes. This day, how you started your day, what your thoughts were this morning, how you've carried yourself through this day, how you've been allowed to have encounters and experiences, some challenging, some more life enhancing, that pushed you forward another day of being here on the planet Earth as a human being. Let's just think about that. After all you've been through, in this day alone, and the many days and years past, how you got here to this prestigious, esteemed university, the choices you made that have brought you to this day, Open your heart and quietly to yourself. Say the only prayer that's ever needed. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're still here and you get another chance this day to do better and be better. Another chance to become more of who you were created and what you were created to fulfill. Thank you.